Hey everyone, and welcome back to Koali Zoo, finally on this channel again. And uh, yeah, I've got two wonderful guests with me today. So let's say hi, first of all, to the lady and Ivan. Hello. Hello, <laughs> hope you guys are doing good. Are, yes. you, are you doing yeah, good? Yeah, Busy as ever. Well. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, busy, busy is a very good segue. <laughs> Thank you for that one. You're welcome. Um, <laughs> So before we, we go off topic again, as always, <laughs> I will just briefly give you guys out there a little idea what's happening today because, oh my God, I've been very busy this week. Uh, I've had the chance to listen to a lot of podcasts because I've been, I've been doing a lot of stuff in Koali. Now, um, Mike has left us with some tasks to do. <laughs> and one of those tasks uh, was that he wanted to have a relocation of Sylph's uh, monkey house. So there was always like these red blocks blocks in, in the mountain area and I think many people saw them and were always commenting what are these red blocks doing <laughs> and I remember even lady asking me what are all these red blocks doing yes <laughs> and um, basically Mike had a location set for this one which was the perfect sideline from the entrance and I don't know I never envisioned what could be in here and make sure that this is on top of somewhere and then I found a picture of something that is also in, in Thailand I guess it was or in, just I thought I think I just googled Indonesia or something and it was like kind of a little crate and in this crate there was like an amazing waterfall going down into a cave uh -huh. um, and this is what we're doing right now. We are building basically this giant cave in which you can go in and then you have basically like a like a funnel that goes down um, and you look up towards the monkey house or which was the monkey house. We still have to see what kind of purpose this thing is going oh, to have. Oh, it's not going to stay a chimpanzee house. No, 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 no it's not. Oh, okay. Okay, it's, interesting. This, this is the kind of thing, Rudy, that like, I don't want to say only you can make, but it's but the kind it is, of thing uh, yes. that you <laughs> would think of and <laughs> exactly my thoughts exactly only rudy is uh, yeah can yeah. do this it was kind of madness yeah but don't get me wrong it was kind of madness because this this build uh, and you guys know how okay so basically to put it in words the most frustrating thing of this episode is lighting yeah. uh -huh. as, as amazing as this game looks they have a significant issue when it comes to dark spots like Yes. Either it's pitch black or it's super weird lighting. There, there's nothing in between. There's no transition. There's no reflective light. And don't get me even started about like uh, ray tracing or whatever. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> oh my God, I ended up lighting this everything by hand. So the final result will not only have uh, this cave system itself. No, even the shadows are mm. hand lit with atmospheric lights. Oh, really? Lights. Oh my oh, god! Because otherwise, I couldn't. I I just could not do it. Otherwise, it, there was no way I can make this look good. And um, actually, it looks very, very neat without people. The the only problem is when people and guests. You will see that later on in the real time <laughs> part. Go there. It's looking a little bit weird because obviously they are lit as well. <laughs> so it looks like oh. glowing people. Um, <laughs> But I think I, I just took that, you know, I just took this little little bit um, and, and thought, okay, you know what, that's the trade-off I can go for. And yeah, you can see here, by the way, this is, this is where the lighting starts. As you can. Oh my. Oh, oh nice. man. <laughs> but at least you have, you have some lights that do the trick. Like, yeah, you, exactly. Uh, yeah. Like not all the lights, I, I don't know what that is. Like, I'm so annoyed by it. Some lights don't do anything when you turn them on. Mm. When, when it's still daytime. I'm, I'm so confused of how... Oh, you have wide... to put... No, no, no. You have to put them on. Yes, that's what I yeah. say. If you put them on, they still don't do anything. Oh, or okay. like that's barely weird. visible. Like some lights, not all of them. And I'm, I'm just confused about what they thought yeah. when they added lights that should work. Why is one working and why is some other one not visible? I, yeah, I really I don't understand. No clue. I, I think no that's, clue at all. I think that's a thing with so many things in this game. Like why is this like this and <laughs> yes. I mean I don't I don't I don't want to have another episode in which in which we bash the game again. <laughs> but but it's it's something that's really noticeable. Yeah. yeah, it, it has its flaws. It has its flaws, yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> 
I think the problem is because they, they raised the bar in some areas yeah. so freaking high and then some things just can't catch up to it. And that's the frustrating exactly. bit. If you, you know, like the landscaping tools, for example, I think they are still the best in any oh, game I've ever had. Absolutely. Like, I think there's yeah. no other game that has these kind of incredible landscaping tools. And then if it comes to lighting and stuff, it's just so frustrating because like if you look in this tunnel, for example, over here uh, down there, it's like nowhere in real <laughs> in real life it would be that pitch black you can't even see anything there there's no, no texture there's <laughs> nothing and like and it's like ah oh. i i would love to be able to create something like that without putting an entire mountain above it because i want to do nocturnal houses and stuff like that yeah but yeah. then that's not possible and um but but it's, this looks this looks thing. really good rudy <laughs> Yeah, you yeah, already it, showed it, me it, a picture, and oh, oh, man, every time scared. he showed me pictures, I was like, <gasps> "Dude, you're mad!" <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's this crazy. And uh, honestly, magician. till till this point in the video, it was all just a proof of concept. I, I sent this to even beforehand, yeah. and this was just I completely completely changed it 100. It was just a proof of concept, and then I knew how I wanted to do it, and I completely resculpted the the oh, whole sweet. mountain, which I did not include in the time lapse because that was just <laughs> a little bit too much. And honestly, you wouldn't notice the difference that much, and this shows how brilliantly it worked because it just looked better, and that's the yeah. only that's the only bit. It just looked so much better, and uh, in the real time part later on when we go inside you can really spot the difference um, that it really worked together awesome. and also one cool bit is and you will see that like, you guys out there will see that from the title um, in the end it ended up being a habitat for the proboscis monkey yes um, wait for so, this is a habitat for the proboscis monkey yes <laughs> I'm pretty yes. sure you sent me a screenshot with a tiger uh-huh yeah <laughs> So you changed that afterwards. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But wait, I, what I tiger? Long... We already had two tigers. No, it was a cloud yeah, leopard. It was a cloud oh, leopard. it was a, oh, oh wow. Okay. Yeah. We were we were talking about <laughs> I it. I saw a cat, okay. <laughs> we were talking about it and then I was like, um, Rudy, don't we have another monkey? And we're like in the monkey slash ape world here. Yeah. Why don't we use that one? And we like it was like we both forgot that it existed in the game. <laughs> <laughs> and it's the only freaking swimming one. Yeah, which was exactly. Oh, yeah. That was like the. That was like a win. Um, so they have this wonderful little lagoon there, down there to swim. And I imagine, like, if you, you know, talking real, real world here, just imagine how clear and cool and great this water would yeah, be. Like exactly. it would be the perfect little pool to swim in. Uh huh. But gosh, them, so, this, yeah. this already, and, and we're only halfway through the the this speed build. It it is already looking looking insane. I oh, absolutely yeah. love the viewing. I love the foliage, what you did with on the mountain. It's it absolutely really insane. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is... Oh, I mean, man, this the is so good. Was, this is insane. It just took ages. You can see there's a huge cut in here. I cut out an entire uh -huh. podcast. <laughs> you did, I see. Yeah, <laughs> because it was just too much. And uh, honestly, the, the the main reason why I cut it out was because the time lapse was too annoying. It was like I was moving in this cave to make mm -hmm. all these... Um, oh gosh, how they're like, wait, wait, they're called, or there, there was a trick to remember how they called stalactites and stalactites or something yeah. like that, like the one going up, the one going down. Um, and yeah, the camera movement was just beyond this world. <laughs> yeah, I and was, especially like, if you right speed in. it up, it can be yeah. so yeah. terrible. But so like, I can totally so yeah, see why you. There's this it. one thing that I really like, and you've seen it a few times in this video already. The way that you made like hanging moss and vines using the weeping willow, that was it brilliant. Works so well. That yes. works so incredibly yeah. well. Totally. Yeah, because I figured like we I remembered them from uh, Planet Zoo, but we don't have them. Like these, you know, these really soaky pirate vines. They are not existing in this game, and I was so sure they are yeah. in here, but these are <laughs> Planet Coaster ones. Correct. And so I, I needed to come up with a solution, and then I figured, you know what, actually the Weeping Willow looks exactly like those <laughs> things, it's... and so I was using them. I was deleting some of them because it was, you know, getting a bit too much, but um, at the end I think I found a good balance in yeah. between using them. Definitely. Uh, so, uh, it looks yeah, there's really a, lot of, good. a lot of stuff. Oh, you! Oh, I can't believe that this is in Planet Zoo. <laughs> that you you can do this. I remember that I at some point had this this like a, like a picture of some kind of crate like this, but mm -hmm. I never thought that would be doable. So I never even tried. 
and you're here just creating this being like oh yeah i will just do that i will just make that and it's just insanely good i just <laughs> yeah thanks it. it's, it's also beautiful. it's also in a part of the park where i was like R rudy and there's also another thing that rudy is going to hint at later on and i was like rudy <laughs> You're doing this in one of the most oh, tightly wait, packed what, areas of, of the okay. park. I don't know. I don't know how you're gonna do it. And he just said to me, <laughs> "Don't worry about it." <laughs> yeah. And and he... I didn't. And I I can see why I didn't worry about it because oh, it's perfect. Yeah. Oh. Really it's like, like it. really the, the 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 space struggle was real. <laughs> like the problem is you can't just move the whole mountain and then you have to nah. re-sculpt a million nah. different things. It's insane. And I I needed to come up with a way to find out what to do and we are mostly done with the sculpting of the cave now. So what I'm doing right now is really setting ground for what is happening in in Evans next week as well. Yeah. Um so I'm not going to tell you guys what he's going to do, but we had a good talk what we are going to do, so I did not <laughs> um destroy his area in fact i actually laid out his let, area let me where tell you let me tell you what happened i will not tell what they said but rudy was <laughs> like oh yeah i wanna uh so so the plan is is and he, he sent a map i think it was and then uh he was like yep yeah, i want to do this and 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 even it's gonna do that and that and that and I was like, are you going to do that all in one episode? Or shall we maybe just make like 10 episodes out of all that what you want to do? Yeah, that, that's and he was what like, I oh, thought. Yeah. Yeah, might actually be a good idea. And I was like, yeah, because maybe I would like to have uh, make, a, make a few habitats too out of all of those animals. So he, I think he, he, he surely mentioned like 10 animals. And I was like, yeah. is that really all you're going to do in one week? Like, let me do something too. <laughs> this, this is, you know, what happens I'm when sorry, I'm I on a roll. Some you know? now. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you get. You get like the safari all over again. <laughs> no, but I really love it. Like, this is exactly the the Kowali 2.0. Like, yeah. we're gonna do uh, oh. a few more episodes for sure. Like, oh, no doubt. So we, there are so many plans now again. Oh. So I, I love that. I just love that. So I and oh, I yeah. looking at all the, the the responses to the the previous episode that we did on my channel. Like many people are just super excited for the return, and that's Not why we do people. it. Uh, I think that is just the most thankful, or how you say that. <laughs> that's that's like like just so Wasn't, much rewarding yeah, for exactly the thing. Absolutely. We do. So this so, is yeah, how you, you did this retaining wall. I was already. <laughs> yes. I already. I was looking at, at the picture that you sent me, and I could see this retaining wall, like in in one of the, like a bit in the back, and I wasn't sure what it was, and I was like, what piece is he using here? <laughs> oh, but that yeah, is so those smart. New African also, plaster, yeah, oh, those. these African plaster pieces do wonders. That you can use them in so many different exactly. ways because basically what you can do is just okay. That's like a little bit um, off topic, but. For you guys out there, if you want to do something with um, a lot of depth in it, you know, the problem w which we have in this game, mostly with some pieces, is that we don't really have um, too much bump maps in there. You know, for example, if you look at the, the, the screens over here, it's looking kind of okay, but there is totally lack, a lack of depth in there because there's mm -hmm. no bump map and it's just like a flat piece of artwork, so to say. However, um, some of these plaster pieces have a different uh, flexi color and the inner piece is a different color than the outer piece and it really doesn't matter what you do but you just have to choose a darker inner color and it makes the whole thing pop even more so you can make things which have a higher contrast by choosing a darker color in the middle and so you can make oh, things nice. look um, so cool. more deep or less deep that's so cool like you've got a very subtle texture or you get like a very crazy harsh texture so, i love that it's just brilliant so that's what you mean with those new plastic pieces right yeah exactly yeah. these from oh, the very Africa good pack. Yeah. thank you it's super cool. You can make you can make almost like gravel look because there is um, a very very tiny one, a round oh, yeah. tiny shape, mm -hmm. and you can make even gravel out of it, looking what? super cool. Um, this I can see that now in the menu. It's like the green one with the yellow yeah, center yeah. in the middle top. This is the one, super nice. But you can also use all these other ones. Brilliant pieces. They are super versatile. Nice. But yeah, yeah. What I'm doing right now, just to give you a bit of a hint, is um, I, I just set up a little backstage area for the chimpanzees because uh, I moved obviously the 
macaques yeah. and the chimpanzees a little bit. I, I'm the good thing is a little still bit. kept some. <laughs> the chimpanzee yeah, but the good thing building is, is just completely to the backside. Of yeah, the, the thing is, the, the habitat for the chimpanzees was uh, it felt bigger than my entire safari. I think that was the biggest <laughs> chimpanzee habitat in the whole world. A sylph really gave them some space. Um, so I just took half away of it, and it's still massive. So there is no big issue. Okay. But they didn't really have a backstage access, so I made this little shelter um, and the macaques also have a completely new building which you will see in the real-time part I just completely cut out the footage because it was too much <laughs> oh yeah I can't imagine oh man yeah. I can't wait to see the real-life footage now yeah me too <laughs> there are so many things in uh, in the speed build alone already that I'm like geez this is just so good so inspiring it's, it's oh, just it brilliantly just so thought much of fun. Yeah, you can see that the struggle was real to oh. make sure that they can access the higher part over here. And I ended up having the issue. And this is, we talked about that last yes, episode. Exactly. The game just does not tell you what's wrong. Mm -hmm. And I figured you can you can rotate the vines up and down, but you never have, you can never rotate them to the sideways. As soon as the angle of these vines is going sideways, they cannot oh. climb them. Okay. Oh, okay. I, did, I legit didn't know that. It just doesn't work. Me the the no. second you have one degree angle to left or right, start, they stopped climbing it. Oh, and really? so I ended up, ended up using these uh, logs over here. Oh, well, yeah, logs so are that's... also fine, especially yeah. for yeah, yeah, I just monkeys. hit them away. True, but I just wanted to keep it natural, so I, I didn't want to make sure it looked like as if um, it was man-made. I wanted to make sure that this is almost like, you know, these monkeys lived there and they just gave them shelter mm -hmm. um, and, and let them remain in the in, the, in this cave. That was the, the basic idea behind mm -hmm. this. So I just gave them this little sunken area here where there is like a little bit of an access to um, some of the uh, viewing stuff that Sylph made. I repurposed them as shelters because I just loved nice. how simple yeah. and good they looked, like to give them some shelter from, from rain or so. And then make sure that this is all sunken into this. So area. this is yeah. on the top of of that crate. No, I'm this guessing. is um, this is what? next to the entrance. Yeah, exactly. Basically, it's next to the zip line. Yes, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so but if they go into that now. cave, then they get to the waterfalls. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. this is connected by a little tunnel system. Ah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, right. In the mountain. <laughs> and then underneath the tunnel, I saw uh, uh, underneath the crate, I also saw like this platform. So there, where's the keeper's gate, for example? Is that on this level or is yes. that on the lower level? Yeah, no, that's on this level. Oh, that's okay. on the right hand side, hidden away in, in the landscaping. Nice. It's actually, you will see this later. This is, I'm just covering up over here. You can see oh, this is where the entrance goes. Oh, yeah. Just I making see. like a little backstage access here. And those, yeah, those sure. plates on the left, those were, were billboards, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I totally missed that you put down the billboards itself. So I was like, oh, yeah. That ah, okay, yeah, yeah. This is, the, this is the foundation for what uh, Eben is going to do next week. Actually, it's the most fitting thing ever when you it sent me the picture and told me and told me how it's called i was like wait what <laughs> this is so good yeah, it, you you guys have to check it out next time it's 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 insane it's something that i like was saving for tarmashadi but then i was like yeah nope this works so this works so <laughs> well that i can't that i can't keep it for tarmashadi i need to use it here so uh, yeah i'm i'm really looking forward to uh to taking on oh, this area. You, you just use that path as a roof? Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Also that's also so really smart. Cool. That's really smart. I mean, smart. this is, is like a frontier, if you're listening. Can we just have that that, that freaking <laughs> gravel? No, as, you can't. As a texture, you can't. Please. I've been asking so many things, but we pieces. can't. <laughs> I'm, I keep asking, okay? I've, yeah. I've seen I've seen art directors hanging out on Twitter, <laughs> checking out some people's stuff. Oh, so yeah. Maybe. Exactly. We need to go on Twitter, I think, for, for things that we want now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> just, we, you know. Well, we finally we, got our mesh fences. Hello. Took us yeah. one and a half years. <laughs> just, you, just, you just need to, is real. You just need to tweet, like, a video of a, a jaguar diving and then... Maybe we should make a yeah. video with all the things that we want and then <laughs> no, send no, 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 no. it everywhere and spam no, them. No, no, with no, no, no. Way easier, people. You have the clip fe feature now on YouTube. You can clip things. <laughs> so do the magic, clip it, and put it all out on Twitter. <laughs> you know what I want? I want something super simple. You know that round window of the plaster pieces? 
Yeah. I want yes. that one in all styles <laughs> of all yes. the building sets. Is that too much to ask? Or like all the plaster pieces, like all the small little plaster pieces in all building styles. That's I, all I want. Just I want put everything. the texture on that <laughs> other uh on that piece from that other set and you're good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll but you're it. asking too much, lady. Yeah. Yeah. You're asking too much. I know. All right. <laughs> Rudy. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, we jumped over into the real time part, guys. I don't know if you guys can see the screen already. Yeah. Yes, I can. Just tell me. Brilliant. Okay, before oh, we start the little good. tour here, uh, uh, can you just go out of my way, please? There's someone going into it. <laughs> okay. I don't know why. <laughs> it just has to settle real quick here. Um, I swear, I did not use any underwater feeders. Can you just stop doing that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, let's stop the salt. Um, so, yeah, basically, um, the reason also uh, next week is again uh, an episode on my channel because I did more than this and we need to set up the stuff for even uh, just to let you know but then he's also going to take over and and has enough time uh, just as a little bit of a of a service for you guys to know so let's do the little move here so you can see this is the area and at the very end of the video you guys will get a transition of a before and after yes i finally i finally thought <laughs> of making sure to put a camera down to have a before and after Seriously? it's not going to be Oh, that's yeah, it's cool. not going to be as great as Zikin's uh, stop motion stuff, which is insane, <laughs> by the way. Yeah. Um, but it's uh, it's still giving you a good hint of before and after. So you can see this is now the new area for the chimpanzees. There is like a little shelter building over here, very I nicely uh, put in in front of this one. Uh, when when even is done, uh, you will see that this makes sense in this position. <laughs> I just exactly. I, I just I just put it here that you know you have some some more interesting things to look at. You have seen how he moved up there. They can have some shelter, and this in the back is a little bit of a nice uh, backstage building. I imagine this could be something where they go inside when there's like super bad weather or something mm -hmm. you know and then uh, we come up this area over here and you can see this is the viewing gallery for the macaques which we are actually not going to use today because this is where the temples had you know previously sit this this was basically now the view onto the temple uh -huh. which now is completely gone and you can't really see it from over here which is um, actually the idea because you'd see that from most parts of the park you can see it but you can't really see it anymore from over here mm -hmm. but what you can see is on the right hand side this is the mm. new macaque area oh, very over here nice. and on the left hand side you can already see a little building there you can see that one people standing here having a nice little glimpse here <laughs> and uh, on the left hand side you know this is I, I just hid away the backstage of yeah. the chimpanzees just make a little bit of a nice seating area and then you can already have a glimpse inside of this area and look at what I did Ooh, that's cool. I made sure this looks like a little bit more um, you know uh, almost like Mount Fuji like oh, or something that. yeah that's um, really cool where you can see that this is tiny bit more like the cold area there are some yeah. coolers in here because at the end of the day these are macaque monkeys and mm -hmm. they, you know they are also suited for some colder temperatures and exactly. um, when it's very hot outside Definitely. they might need some shelter so this is also why you see a lot of greenery on top to make sure that this is really kept cool also energy efficient mm -hmm. there are some coolers and stuff on top I, I don't know if you can see them let me see I try to hide them away <laughs> but so that you can maybe see them a little bit the, the idea was to just still get the idea I know oh, so they cold. Sh should be somewhere <laughs> over there but yeah <laughs> I like the idea though, definitely. Yeah, so that you can see. Um, this is also where the people are running uh, through my barrier, which they shouldn't. <laughs> but, uh, look at that, this is the work in progress barrier and I, I love billboards, you know that I love billboards. Oh, this so. is great. <laughs> <laughs> we have some plastic uh, stuff hanging, very low cost, very easy. Uh, so yeah, and then you get a very much more uh, good view over oh, here. Oh, I look, like there's, that. Yeah. There's really a magic good. macaque. Oh yes, so just you gotta have a magic cool. macaque. Else yeah. just Why so does this boring. always happen when it's yeah. your episode, Rudy? I I mean, uh, come on! Sure I, you know, <laughs> my monkeys are cursed. I have no idea whatsoever is going on. <laughs> but yeah, you can see this is their wonderful interior. You can have a little glimpse in here. There's some some rocks and stuff. And yeah, it's really um, nice. Yeah. Very nice. I really I like to have different height elevations as well. Yeah. Oh my God. Elevations. <laughs> yes. Yeah, very interesting. Very uh -huh. easy. To <clears throat> uh -huh. Before we go in there, just to give you a glimpse, we are just yeah. going to go up here oh, to don't save let the us best wait for more. the last. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm already running up the hill. So here you can see this is a little bit uh, nicely laid out wow. here for the backstage access, so very cool. settled. And uh, you know, coming up here, you can already see this is this is now where the zipline adventure uh -huh. is. And look how high are you? You it's are already. Insane already. You yeah. already have like a very nice view. You can see now the lower part of the chimpanzee habitat. You can see uh, basically the monorail passing by. You can see the zipline adventure. Now you get a very nice view of the zipline. You can see the uh, camera that tree you still used. There, that will kill <laughs> you, you can see the camera I used, exactly. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, Rudy. I had to say that. <laughs> yeah, I know. I mean, it's, it's very obviously floating in midair here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, that's so, hilarious. yeah, this is... This is then uh, the stuff you saw in the speed build. I'm just going to go up a little oh, bit. Oh, so yes. Okay. The... And this is the proboscis monkey. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Oh, really so you cool. can see the retaining wall a little bit more nicely. And this was oh, like... And you can nice. see again. This was like the animal. When when we thought of this, everything kind of fell into place. Like, And that's exactly. the thing that I like so much. Yeah, well, the only really thing is, this is an sense. Asian animal and this is an African region, isn't it? Well, this is, no, no, this no, no. is still this the is... monkey slash ape. Area. Oh exactly. yeah, okay. And the no, African that, that area is, okay. is more um, towards Africa. The... Is there? Yes. Yeah, exactly. that's true. Yeah, you're this correct. This is Africa. So yeah. All right. Um, all right. <laughs> it looks really we... good. Really well done. Okay. Now we come back yeah. to the to the yes. to the exactly. big one. Exactly. Let's the star go for of it. The show. Let's stop tiptoeing and around over. it. <laughs> Let's yes. just do it. By the way, how <laughs> cool is that? That I'm just running and we're still around 20 ish FPS, which is pretty cool, I guess. That's really good. So here we go. I'm just going to zoom in a little. God. You can see what I meant with the glowing people. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I see. Um, <laughs> but I guess I so guess I, in in areas like this, they would also put in um, actual lights. Yeah, exactly. Lights. You can see. So Definitely. this is what I did here. So we have some actual lights over here because this exactly. makes sense. You would put some in here as well. Um, so wow. you have this very nice area, and then you come down here. Oh, look at that! There's already a proboscis oh, wow. monkey swimming. Look at there this. There are three swimming. Oh, cool. Yeah. Four. They have a good time down there. Wow. And now, when we go down here, I'm just going to zoom out. Look at this. Oh, Look at wow. how that comes oh, that together. That looks really good. That is great. And then this is where you can see now the, and I love that. the house. And the, on top, you have the little glimpse. Now it makes all sense. You want to go amazing. there. You want to try out the trail. And if you come out of here, and this plaza, by the way, is far from being done. Uh, this is where you would come out there and then you have this little um, arrow hinting down, you know, towards the, mm -hmm. the temple. And yeah. then you would, this, this would really make sense, you know, then you have really had this in mind. And uh, yeah, so wow. if we go forward a little bit to, you can see there's this little uh, mesh fence I used and then you can see there are all the monkeys swimming, enjoying their time. Oh, by the way, um, can you see this, the, the water splashing effect? Uh -huh, yeah. Uh -huh. I found out that the, um, what was it, the 10 meter, the 10 meter waterfall bottom piece, if you turn that around 180 degrees, it just totally crashes and creates this. Seriously? And it just looks, finally looks like cool splashing water. That's really which, cool. But you, yeah, you, because you also use like the enrichment item, right? Yeah, yeah, there's the sprinkler in as well, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that also solves it. That's yeah, that's smart. really cool. It's just because this has the, the the sprinklers have this little bit of fogginess to yeah. it. Yeah, so yeah. This is why I use them. Uh, they're so also smart. in here, as you can see around there. It's a little bit of a pity you can't put them too close to each other because yeah. then you know, uh, so they are not in the perfect spots everywhere. But yeah, this is this is where the water falls down over here. You can see flowing over this the rocks over there and, and just having this one coming right out of here. Another really flowing nice. over there and. That looks yeah. really cool. Your rock work and stuff is also really great. Oh, Especially gosh, like the was, part yeah. in behind you, like the, the stalactites, stalactites, I don't know how you say that the in The cave English. things. <laughs> yeah, the cave things. <laughs> yeah. um, I, I, oh, it's great. I really like that it. That looks really good. Yeah, and then I, I can also give you a glimpse inside of the water just to show you that there is actually also a ton of work has been done oh, in here as well. Wow. Um, because otherwise it just looks really, this this is needed uh, because this is not all reflections. It's very hard to see though. But if you don't do anything down here, it, the reflections look super yeah. weird. Now this is basically a kind of combination of the reflections as you can see and what is going on down here with the foliage. You can see there's the foliage a little bit and there's the reflection. Yeah. So you had to do this that in order to get this. Wow. Yeah, to get this like lagoon-ish style. 
So yeah, oh, really nice. This is it. This beautiful is it. work, Rudy. Mm. Really well beautiful. done. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. Yeah, I let's really just like move it. Really a little well bit done. back here to get a bit of a better view here. Let's use our superpowers to go up this hill. There you go. I think that's a cool view. Yeah. Definitely. Let's see, this is well. Really well done. Yeah. So, so this what are it. you going to do in the next week? So next week is most likely going to be maybe only a tour. Yeah. I think to, uh, I think what I'm doing over there is not really worth the time lapse because that's gonna be madness. <laughs> um, and a tour will be enough. It will. It might be a shorter episode, but that's fine, I guess. <laughs> to, for once. Definitely. Um, but totally uh, yeah, it's gonna be like a little tour, and this tour is gonna set up uh, the yeah, the start for the next coming weeks uh, of Kuali guys. Exactly. That's very oh, cool. Oh, so excited. And but didn't you have like a before and after picture? Is that for, for next week? No, no, no. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this, uh, edit this in here in the end. When but we, I, I want to see it too. <laughs> you, have this, you have it in the chat. It's in the chat. <laughs> it's in the chat. It's already in the oh, chat. Oh, no. You even reacted yeah, to it Yeah, you already. even liked oh, it. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Never mind. <laughs> I know oh, which one. Yeah, okay. Okay. I know so, which one it was. So, yes. like... That's really like good. for for people to know like this part and and these are things that we are both going to work on and the thing that I like that I like the most Rudy is I have like this book on zoo design and you and there's an entire chapter about like the artist vision and like the concept art and everything and then what happens when animals are introduced and I like that yin and yang kind of way like you have this, you, you create like this mm, mm, so incredibly beautiful artistic vision of it. And then you, you, there are things that you're like, okay, to make this more of a zoo, you need to adjust this and this. And I liked that, that interaction between the two. So that's, that's absolutely, yeah. That's going to be a lot of fun as well. <laughs> <laughs> for you certainly you <laughs> <laughs> yeah but but i oh, like that I, I like the yeah. i like that idea of like Whoa. you have the very cool artistic vision and then you have and it's in the book itself it just it's, it literally says and then animals come in and mess up everything <laughs> yeah exactly could you could yeah, you that's, zoom that's out maybe a little true. bit from from above Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Sure. Let's let's quickly do this. Oh my. Whoops. Oh, that's very busy. Why is busy. like everyone over here? What? I don't know. Oh god. I only I only opened it for four thousand people. Look, we only have. <laughs> it's time for a traffic fix. Uh, Wait. AKA uh, City Skylines uh, <laughs> versus Planet Zoo fix. Gosh, but I'm just surprised like how well this save still works. It's it's yeah, insane. Gotta... Like uh, we've yeah. we've talked about this like quite a lot already. I have already. to be careful now. Just keep on talking. I'm just <laughs> positioning the camera right. so we don't spoil anything. So, so, so like that should be fine. I I can now load wow. the file in like six minutes. Six minutes. Six. It's really insane. That's insane. Yeah. Oh wow, that's amazing. And and this this yeah. this map is has so many pieces. I'm yeah, uh, just yes. two. I'm responsible for like half of them, but uh, <laughs> <yes>. <laughs> for sure you are. I'm, I'm sorry, <laughs> <laughs> but it, it's insane how well the performance keeps up with with definitely yeah, everything absolutely. that we've done. Um, so yeah, we're totally ready for another twenty episodes of Kawami. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, just just to, just to boil it down to what you just said, because it's still running so well. But look at what a, kind of a massive area we just gained. <laughs> yeah. Um, but sure. I gotta say, there's not a lot going on in terms of animals because this is mostly what Mike still envisioned. So I yeah. didn't really change that much. He already put like the the boxes here, and he made sure that this is going to be like a water flow. This will be like a massive water. Element element that feeds basically all the water elements in the zoo. I remember Mike had this idea very early on and Sylv Lady and I were like, what the hell is he envisioning there? And <laughs> there was like, I think this whole part of the zoo did not exist at this point. And he was already putting like waterfall marks and stuff in. Um, and now it makes sense because we have this big gigantic water source over here. Uh -huh. And maybe this temple sits very close to this thing. So that could be like a very nice idea to, to wrap this area off. Um, and then yeah we have this like let me zoom in a little bit to show you this is where the big hole is and i think it really fits in now. yeah it blends it's just in not, it, super it well it you works know, it, well 
sense. Yeah, and for if, sure. And if this is where the big sauce is, it makes sense that you have some water over here as well. You know what I mean? It's yeah. Like, mm -hmm. it, it's all in the mountain. There is like the water is flowing out here and to the other side. And this is why I put it here. It just, it made sense. Definitely. It looks definitely. Amazing. Looks really good. So next yeah, week so again on the on your channel, and then after that, Even is going to take over, and he's yes. gonna need two or three weeks as well because yeah, he has yes. so many big I, I I I build a little bit slower than Rudy, <laughs> but but yeah, I'm I'm gonna need at least two weeks um, to get it all finished. But we've got some crazy ideas for you, and uh, yeah, I exactly. hope that it's. And I, and I don't hope that you're gonna like it. I know you're gonna like it, so. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> this is, I, I mean, you know, when there is one thing that even is insanely good at, guys, you know that he's incredibly good at interiors and, and oh, these yeah. facility buildings. Um, he's ridiculously good at oh. that, and we made we we made it in a way that he really can can make <laughs> his stuff shine in there. So I I, I did not even touch this, you know. There is so much stuff he's gonna do which will blow your way, and oh. um, yeah, I'm very I'm very happy to show you next week's stuff because this will this will hopefully spark your guys' imagination a lot. Let's hope so. So yeah, super. At least for me, it does really well done, cool. Rudy. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> you really yeah, that, let's. Let's wrap it up here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, thank you guys so much for being here. Being yes, a very nice guest. Thank you for having guest. us. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so Next much. Next week again. Thank you indeed. Yay. And uh, yeah, guys, I really hope you liked this video. If you did so, you know the drill, you know, click that button and so on. Make the algorithm notice us. Um, <laughs> and also make the algorithm notice Ivan and, and Lady. Go go check their channels out if you haven't already. Yes. And, and give them a follow. Especially even this time because he needs to put you all the, all the little sneak peeks and stuff. What yes, he's exactly. Doing yes, exactly. Will so, be on his community wall. Exactly. So I, I know I'm, I need a little bit more time, but I will be sure to update you guys as much as possible. So good. So good. I'm cool. Excited. Ben, thank you guys so much and have a wonderful Saturday. Goodbye. Right. Goodbye.